Hey guys, welcome back. Today we are going to be learning how to make bubble tea and I am so excited for this because when we went into isolation and everything kind of shut down, I knew the only thing that I was going to miss that I didn't think I could make at home was going to be my uh, usual boba fix that I get. So I'm really excited to learn how to make this stuff and I'm going to share it with you today. If you don't know what boba is, it's a tea based drink usually that has milk in it and then the actual boba that we're talking about or if you're on the east coast you sometimes called bubbles um, the actual boba or bubbles are little tapioca pearls and so today i have bought some pre-made packaged tapioca pearls and we're going to cook those we're going to brew the tea and i'm going to show you how to make the drink Fun fact is that these take a really long time right now to come through Amazon, but if you have access to an Asian grocery store or like an H Mart or something like that, you can pick some of these up from there. They usually have several different brands that are prepackaged. All right, so let's go see what supplies you need to make your boba today. This video brought to you by Asian Pacific American Heritage Month. Each May, we celebrate the unique stories and rich histories of Asian Americans and Pacific Islanders. Now, we might be closed because of COVID-19 this May, but that doesn't mean that you can't check out lots of great ebooks and e-audiobooks by and about Asian Americans and Pacific Islanders. We have a great selection of titles available for you to enjoy anytime. You can browse our curated list of celebratory reads over on Overdrive and read or listen to your heart's content. And now, back to the video. a really weird angle but what can you do i'm gonna assemble my tea now so i have decided to do matcha tea with my boba today uh, i'm gonna go ahead and pop my ice out of my ice tray and put it in a bowl so that it's just like ready for grabbing whenever it's time to assemble my drink i'm gonna try to assemble it in those like pretty layers that you see We'll put on Instagram before I stir it up and drink it, but we'll see how it goes. Okay, ice in a bowl, put the rest of the ice in the freezer. I'm done with that. Um, okay, so matcha o'clock. I have some vanilla matcha powder in a little bit of water there. Looks really appetizing, I know. Um, and then I'm gonna just blend this up with my Nutribullet. Oh, I put some honey in it too because honey got stuck to the bottom. <laughs> because uh, matcha without sweetener, zero out of 10 is not recommended. <laughs> She's blended. She's looking green. Mmm. Okay, let's do this. I'm gonna take my straw out and just set it very carefully down because it's made of glass. I'm scared to break it. Um, mason jar. Boba. I'm gonna put the boba in first because you want in the picture the layers are always like on the bottom. And I read that if you put the boba in first, then the ice. Then like the milk tea mixture, it helps keep things layered. I don't know, we're gonna try it. So glass, boba, step one. Let's see how it goes. I like a lot of boba in my bubble tea, so I have a lot. <laughs> I put, these boba stick to everything, by the way. If you have like a single boba and it has no other boba to stick to, it will stick to the, everything. All right, so I have about, I don't know, how many inches is that? Like an inch? It's like an inch of 
uh, tapioca pearls in here. And then now I'm gonna put in my ice for my next layer. I'm gonna put in quite a bit of ice. I hope I have enough here in my bowl. Shoot, lost one. My dogs will eat that. Look, ice cube. There he goes. All right, so boba, ice, and I want that ticket. It. It's kicking it up. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna pour in my matcha. Okay, and now here's hopefully where we will get the layers with the milk. Again, I'm using almond milk, but you can use whatever milk you have at home or you prefer. All right, pour her in. Make layers, baby. Okay, no, there's no layers. So there's like pseudo layers. You see that? Boom. It's kind of like a little more like clouds than layers, I guess, but straw. And so normally when you get boba at the actual tea place, they put like a, excuse me, they put like a plastic lid on the top. And so then you shake your boba, your tea, whenever you get it, but put a metal lid on and then shake it. But I have long since lost the lid. So I'm just gonna stir it. My straw here. I don't think that I can overstate how excited I am right now to try this because I have been desperately missing my uh, boba fix while we've been in quarantine. Okay, let's try it. Wait. I can get any boba. Let's try again. That's it, sis. So, voila. That's how you make your own bubble tea at home. I hope you enjoyed the books that we talked about. I hope you're enjoying your bubble tea right now. And we will see you in our next video. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I'm going to go back to drinking this. Bye.